up, everybody? Welcome back. We're hanging with Scarcasm. Geese gone raw. We got Blue. We got Scar. We got me, Crucial Chase. And this time, I'm bringing some emo as fuck. This is okay. American football. Never meant. Uh, they're pretty much. I would consider them my favorite emo band. I I would I would think. I didn't grow up with a lot of the earlier emo. I respect it, but I didn't grow up in the early 80s, so um, something that came out in the late 90s is kind of what I would grow up with. So um, this, to me, is old. my emo. Yeah, old. Not as old as someone that grew up with Fugazi, but still old. <laughs> so, <laughs> All right. So let's, let's get it. Get it in. Y'all see how old that monitor was on the computer desk? I just wanted to point that out. <laughs> That's old CRT. I'm, I'm talking about the Polaroids, dog. Except for, it seems like we're moving out. Yeah, that's what it seems like, yeah. I've been to so many parties like that where it's just a rhythmless nation around me. The story is back in tell. was an iMac, bruh. Did you see them seats? Did you see the steering wheel coming? This is clearly an old video, but still. 
That was an iMac, dog. Oh, that's real steel door. <laughs> real American steel, bro. A real American steel, there. Huh? Real American steel, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I, I you the, the person who person who owns that is probably someone that says, I tell you what, a lot. <laughs> Boy, I mean to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what. <laughs> Real American steel. So 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 Chase, yeah. all what that what that told me okay. is that so I, cause I've heard some other emo and it was not like this, right? So to me, this just felt like this felt like what would be an R and B ballad when I was back in middle school. You know what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. That's kind of what it felt like to me. And like it evoked similar uh, emotional connotations for me. So, so yeah, man. Well, I, mean, I, just, I had brought to, ta to the table, I mean, Burial wasn't complete full-on dubstep, but like I had brought, I, I do want to educate on, there's some genres that change sounds over time and keep the name. Like, oh, okay. like say, so like if you go with the '80s emo, it would be like bands like Fugazi or Rites of Spring, and then mm -hmm. '90s would be like Sunny Day Real Estate, um, American Football, uh, Captain Jazz, and things like that. And then in okay. the 2000s, it kind of shifted towards like your Mike and Mogul Romance and Paramore and things like that. Which I mean, I'm not knocking that. It's just I didn't grow up with that, right. and that's not my emo. <laughs> <laughs> right, but, right. Not your emo. <laughs> and emo of the '90s actually was fairly musically proficient and technical. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, they had they had some. He had a couple of harmonies in there, and now, um, my only my only criticism of it is the time signature. I just I just couldn't catch a groove. Uh, you can you couldn't feel it. I I can I can catch I can catch I can catch a groove. Like it was a, it was it was cool and it felt all right. You know, it was a little bit yeah. sad, but mm -hmm. but the time signature, especially with the from the drums, is just kind of like let me, let me down let me down a path where I'm just kind of like no, I just kind of want to groove right now. Like it's, <laughs> right, right, right. There's a, there right. was no yeah I didn't I ain't had no groove like and that's I think that's a lot of a lot of the songs that we do that I don't really love is the songs where I can't catch a groove. Yeah, I want yeah. a groove, girl. What a groove. Got to. Got to feel it in your bones, man. Got to groove. Um, Got to feel it in your, in your chest. Yeah. But no, that was pretty good. Uh, that's, that's pretty good, Chase. Like, that's pretty yeah. good, man. Yeah, yeah I liked yeah. it. Yeah. I just can't I, catch a groove. I always fe fear that I'm going to bring something that, like, means a lot to me, and you guys are going to be like, man, that's some... Come on, son. Or right. something, you know? <laughs> and I'm like, <laughs> man. <laughs> I, would, I would never, never hurt your feelings in that way. You're not a nightmare. Right. Um, <laughs> I would never intentionally. I would never intentionally hurt your feelings. Right, right. No, man. I, I think I think this was um this was this was a good switch up, and you know it did let me know that okay maybe I had maybe some of my prior understandings of of emo um have been uh you know I guess renewed as my you were saying as. As the genre yeah. changes over time, it kind of morphs. The know. emo that I know of is the is the two thousands emo that he was speaking of that he said is not yeah. his. That's right. that's the emo that I know. And I think about. that's what's in my head when I hear it. I think that's what's in well, my head. The cool thing is, bands in the twenty ten. I mean, there's definitely still bands like My Chemical Romance now, but the um, there was bands in the twenty tens that evoked this style more. So I, I do have some more stuff coming later that um, okay. kind of and they actually considered that emo revival, even though emo didn't really go away. But it was a revival of this sound, <clears throat> or return to yeah, yeah to this to this. Style. Yeah, got you, got you, man. That's pretty good, Chase. I enjoyed it, man. Cool. Yep. Well, thank you guys for checking out this reaction, or just our our videos are less reactions and more just chilling and listening to music. Wouldn't you say? <laughs> but um. <laughs> Well, I mean, we're we're actually talking about it, so the right, hints yeah. the reaction part. Right, right, right. But um, but yeah, like, share, subscribe, and um, comment. You know, and more suggestions. Uh, I mean, we um, we have a lot of Nightwish, so we don't need any more Nightwish. But anything else, uh, feel free to put in there. Because once I move the Nightwish into a different list, 
there's not as many viewer suggestions as I thought there were. So yeah, definitely put some more viewer suggestions um, in the sure. comments. And um, peace out to the Warriors. And see you guys in the chat. Peace out, Joe.